So we was at the bar the other night and I just kinda, I really had no business going that night. So we went to the bar and this girl, this girl uh, wanted me to drink. Now I remind you guys and ladies, depending on if you're around a girl or a guy that you're cool with, you get comfortable around friends and you want to be a part of the group, you want to hang out. This girl, she was an attractive girl, you know, she's pretty. She wanted me to take some shots for her. I told her I don't drink. And she was like, why not just one? I was like, I'm good on just one. I learned my lesson with that, like going to the bars and things like that, just one to turn into one more. I turn into bro, we almost done, we got these last shots. It's always one more shot. It's always one more, you know what I'm saying? And that's not for me. I don't take part in any of those things. So she started to get upset. Why are you gonna take the drink? What's wrong with you? <laughs> I'm like, nothing's wrong with me. I just don't drink. She was like, why? Really don't have an answer to that. Even though I do got an answer, but now she's just kind of, you know, just digging that stuff. But uh, yeah, you have to, knowing who I am as a person, I can be comfortable in the room without taking shots, without drinking. And when you're in these cities where alcohol is like, there are states or countries or cities where they're known for drinking. I really believe that Salina, Kansas is known for drinking, at least where we're at, the side of the town and city we're at. But though, these people drink every day, the same people I see in the bar, intoxicating themselves with alcohol 24-7. Alcohol causes you to make horrible choices, yo. It causes you to make horrible choices.